Hello, it's Steve Amy, Sam Phillips, and I'm joined by Runco manager Billy Painter. Billy, thanks for joining us. Uh, one nil win, three consecutive wins, three clean sheets. How do you feel directly after that one? As we played today, probably not. I'm so not happy how we played and performed. Felt it was a bit flat. It adds sort of a feeling of the Hanley game, which we want to get caught on the counter. I sort of as a feeling that's why I didn't want it to be too expansive with the full backs and uh, midfielders pushing on. So I felt we were a bit wasteful in possession and trying to force things. Uh, but listen, give credit to 1874. They made it hard for us, difficult for us. Made us force things. Uh, and again, I think they'll be disappointed that they've, they've lost today, drop points. Is it a draw a fair result? <laughs> Maybe, because the way we were looking, it would be a bit scrappy and wasteful in the final third. Said that half time, it might have to take, you know, a, scruff, a scruffy goal. Well, on, the, on a, thankfully for us, uh, Will Saxon's claiming it was a chip. You know, it was a, a misplaced cross, but we'll take it. Uh, it's a one-nil win. Another three points. Another plus is another clean sheet. Yeah, no, a couple of positives to take. Obviously, Will with another goal today, but the big one really is to get some minutes in the legs of Ryan Brook. How is important is it to to have a player like that back? Listen, he's a key player for us. We've, you know, we have missed him. Uh, he brings that experience up top. We can't always rely on Oli at times, so we, we've got to share that workload between two very good strikers. Yeah, now we've got a full week now to, to rest up before we go in the Holton Derby against Widnes. Now, how does prep look for that one? Well, looking on how we were finishing, we were having a few limps. Uh, you know, Lynch's got a dead leg, Doyle's got a knock, Jack's. So there is a few little niggles. We assess them over the next couple of days, uh, get them in training, and, you know, you know, wrap a bit of cotton wool around people. Yeah, just a final word on Anthony K. Missed today through a, a bit of a minor calf injury. Can you just give us an update on that? Yeah, well, we pushed him up into midfield. Uh, you know, a lot of hard work they've put in defensively, impressing and keeping us solid in that base of midfield. Mostly was a heavy pitch. Tuesday night was a lot of work, intensity for him. Uh, you know, he's, he's 42 years young. So, we, you know, we, we, even though he's a fit lad, we've still got to manage him because he's got a fantastic attitude.